damn, it's a lot of dragons sleeping. The father of fire. Who you know who does it better than this? I'm the boy who done did it. I'm on top of the list. Trying to get a good signal like a satellite dish. Every day to me. It's like a solar eclipse. Uh -oh. What's up, y'all? Shabu and I'm some coolest at Afghan Geek. Welcome to my channel. About to dive right into the fifth episode of the OTA Dragon's Blood. I legit took a nap and I woke up. Now I'm I'm planning to finish the rest of the season. I really enjoyed the first first episode. Uh, the previous episode ended with the Elf War. Seems like a, a lovers quarrel. They had a kid together, and that the uh, Empress doesn't wanna like acknowledge the kid's name i guess the kid did not grow up the way she wanted the kid to grow up but the dad is okay with it and it's gonna start this elf war with dragons involved this show is mad interesting like i said it's like castlevania meets uh lord of the rings and i'm here for it you know what i'm saying i'm really here for it let's not waste any more time let's just dive right in a thousand years ago, they go in the war Aren't you guys elves too? So some Nazi shit. Dark Moon Order. That's what they call. Doctor Strange? <laughs> they teleporting to the battlefield? That's so cool though. They actually getting teleported different areas? Or one specific area? God damn. They're actually different areas. Yo, this is such a planned attack. They were just minding their own business. Yo, you all mash. They armored up. God damn. Ooh. God damn. Power. This is what power looks like. The goddess of the moon. Oh yeah, he turned into a full... Dragon Divion and took them and flew them away. I guess he can control the dragon a bit if he can save them Were they terrified the whole ride? It's Divion Davion. It's Davion, Divion, whatever his name is Divion sounds better to me You gonna have a conversation with the dragon? He's fully armored up Is it about to be a Naruto Nine Tails type of battle? Damn, it's a lot of dragons sleeping. Doesn't help the father of fire. Yo, I totally forgot about the demon dude in the first episode. He's been quiet. Goddamn. This dragon designs are cool though. Is that gonna heal him? Damn. Sly Rack. Damn. Run. No time to dilly gag. <laughs> Yo, they going cliff diving? They going cliff diving. That side look Cyrek is giving them though. Damn. That was a bad landing. Smack yourself. I need to wake up. I need to wake up. You learn what? They're gonna see that he worked with with the dragon of fire to beat the dragon of demons. <laughs> the strong one is injured? Marcy legit has no dialogue. What is that necklace? They must be hella confused. You save us, then you kill us? Damn. What an escape plan. Dragons got powers, yo. <laughs> They like uh, the spirit world in the Lost Airbender. He remembers everything now. If they can do this the whole time, why is it not part of the natural order? No lie, that that, that dragon has the coolest design. The one with the eyes and the wings. Are you trying to like get sympathy from dragon? What do they still need to ask him? The dude is searching, searching. For sister ass. <laughs> Let's take a look at that leg. Is it broken? God damn. No sound still. She must be the most cheapest animation character ever. No voice acting needed. <laughs> no grounding, no 
Not even an ouch. The shopkeeper said she sees it. How you gonna get there with the dragon up there? They know your whole life from touching your forehead, or they just know this is a casual dragonite. Damn. He's so honest to them. Ooh. She's the distraction. She's doing crazy moves, though. Is she aiming at those two bones? My whole fucking village? God damn. Damn. The dude is mad cocky in front of dragons. I guess they eat spirits of dragons. They can't do shit to him. But read his mind. She's injured. What a conflicting situation to be a dragon and hate dragons. Terrorblade. Go for the bone. Damn. She's gonna make it in the nick of time before they decide to kill Davion's body. She actually brought him down? Damn. Size difference. I've never seen him not speak this much. He snapped out of it? He's about to turn into the dragon here. Dude been naked in this whole show, <laughs> essentially. I should put out a big fight though. Hey, she's back. There's so many characters they juggling, so some of them get left on the wayside for an episode. Then you're like, oh yeah, you. They went through a lot this episode though. What a great episode. It was basically understanding the dynamic between Davion and the dragon. I keep forgetting his name, but I'll get it eventually. I'm mad. I'm a mad fan of this now. You know what I'm saying? I'm hooked. Um, Let me think. The elves destroyed the other elves. I think they took some prisoner because I remember them standing in the circle and there was a bunch of elves in the middle. And she declared herself the only moon goddess. Seeing the dragons have their council, the designs of the dragons, mad cool. I wonder how Divion is going to reconcile with the fact that he hates dragons. But he did say he knows demons are worse, so that he'll probably understand that he has to work with the dragon for now. But probably the last battle will be between him and the dragon. Oh, that would be so epic. Like final season type of shit. On some Yugi versus the Pharaoh. I'm here for it, you know what I'm saying? I am so here for it. Anyway, like, subscribe if you're not subscribed. Deuces.